The Springboks proved Saturday's 27-13 victory over England at Twickenham, which solidified their place as one of the top contenders for next year's World Cup, was unfounded and dispelled British perceptions of them as a boring team. I think the the one thing, uh, uh, it, it's, it's a cliche, but I think the forwards were outstanding today. They, they gave us a nice platform to attack off and, and I think then the, the backs used their opportunities, you know, when they when they got that good platform. So I thought uh, it was a team effort in terms of the forwards really laying a nice foundation for us and the backs uh, having a go. The box won the game by a score of two tries to one, but this does not accurately reflect the outcome of the match. If it went for another red card, this one given to the reserve prop Thomas Dutoit, shortly after he entered the field due to a technical error rather than malicious intent, England might have been beaten by 20 or 30 points. I think we have been faced this year. Or, you know, we, we had a red card before, so we, we prepared for it. And all I said to the guys, nothing changed. We just keep on going and we just work harder for one another. That was the big message. They already knew. So... You just have to work for an extra man, um, each and every single guy on the team. And I thought um, having eight forwards made it a little bit easier for us. So it was a great call from the coaches. The idea that a team lost two of its four games on tour made the biggest statement in the Northern Hemisphere's November international season. It may seem bold, but we're glad that they bounced back to make a statement. Olana Thekan for Sweety TV Sports.